morning hey y'all hey welcome to my channel you are now entering life with nikki nicole i am nikki or nicole or miss nicole whichever one you would like to call me um we're up and edit early this morning We're about to take a little road trip so i figured why not go ahead and do a vlog on today we're headed to going up to the wrong side you on the wrong side yep we're headed to go. dallas get me off of there like this Before to get our hair done. <laughs> Uh -oh. I know I look sleepy y'all, but you know that mother be that mother jump into you, you'll be on your back to travel by themselves, even though they know how to travel by themselves. So, you know, okay, girl, my you. wig look good on here. Okay, y'all back. I'm, I'm back. I know y'all wonder why I'm we're sitting sideways, but um we don't have we do got a core mount in here, but we don't have it up. But anyway, so we're getting some gas, we're about to get on the highway and all of that, so I just came in just to chit chat a little bit and say good morning. Let me see. Green apple. I couldn't see. I like green apple. I what couldn't smell, smell it. it so. Ooh, yeah. Why ain't you born? Mm -hmm. Cause I couldn't smell it. I ain't know what it smelled like. It oh, smelled good. I can't even put that up there. Let's put it right here. Mm, that's not good. I always, when I do these kind, I always get like three or four. Let me just let it in the They need these in the little thing. This one I can grow it. Like green apple. apple. Well, green apple is the apple you eat. You know what I'm saying? Just, y'all y'all know i worked last night so i'm up now not really up i got my blanket she driving so i do have a, a energy drink this morning <sighs> just a little something something not much but anyway y'all we about to get on this highway and take y'all with us y'all getting ready to go on a little trip with us so we're going to my daughter's shop well not her shop but where she works for her to get her hair done so it's her birthday weekend my baby is 20 finna be 20. <laughs> yeah but i've been 20. go ahead and i feel me up what all right, y'all. We about to hit the road. I don't want this the part of the camera to be jumping. I know why. Um, I know the reason why I wasn't using the camera. I gotta have a memory cord. So until I get a memory cord, y'all. Peace out. We'll be back later. Hey, y'all. Hey. So we making a quick stop at Bucky's right quick. Hey y'all, what's up, what's going on? So we have made it um, 
to Dallas. We're at the shop where my daughter works. And I'm gonna give y'all just a quick, 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 quick um, look at where she works. I'm very proud of her. Um, God has blessed her hands to make women and men, whichever. I am so proud of my daughter, y'all. So well, I'm in the bathroom right now. I had to come and use the restroom. My phone is about to die, but I'm gonna try to get y'all a quick, quick, quick look at where she works. I am really, really proud of her. I'm so proud of her, y'all. Like I said, God has blessed her hands to make women and men, if that's so beautiful. Um, she does a great job with her, y'all, and I'm really, really proud of her, regardless of what the naysayers may say, regardless of what she has done in her past or what, whatever she's doing. I'm still proud of her, so let's take a quick tour. I ain't lying. I ain't hiding. I've been grinding, multiplying. I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away. You guys ain't posting the pictures, trying to look like you're winning. I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen, soaking the moments we live in, yeah. You got the nerve to be on me, faking your life that I had you. If you got my number, don't ask me, cause baby, I'm on high and need us. Baby, don't check for me Taking time out to me And live my life off the screen Taking time out to me And live my life Just building this was season big foundation Make a name for generations Please and make a and take a break or a little vacation and chase and blues away hey, hey. You always posting a pictures trying to look like you winning or look like you always be working Soaking the moments you live in Yeah You got the nerve to be on me Faking your life for the IG If you got my number, don't ask me Cause baby, I'm okay Hey y'all, 
y'all. So I'm finished with the Zoom call. And yeah, we're about to uh, go get something to eat because your girl is hungry. Then we're about to get back on this road and head back home to Houston. Um, so yeah, we're about to um, go get something to eat. And then I'm going to come back and talk to y'all. Okay, y'all. So yeah, this is the restaurant, Louisiana's famous fried chicken and you know i am a louisiana girl so we're gonna see if this chicken tastes like it's from louisiana that's the building it's fairly small but um yeah it looks um looks like it might be good they have slushies um they got a chicken tender combo but i'm actually i'm gonna get some chickens so the girls are already going in like i said to order and so yeah i'll be back Okay, y'all, I'm back, y'all. So while we sitting here waiting, y'all, I just thought I would just come in and talk. You know, I like to talk anyway. But anyway, y'all, so, you know, I put out a video yesterday just speaking on a little uh, transparency in my life and what's going on with me and some things that I really need to work on as far as a permanent change in my life. You know, um, a lot of times we work on things in our life or we try to change things in our life and it just seems like we can't accomplish that we always um revert back to our old habits our old ways you know what i'm saying and i'm really trying to really heal completely in my life i'm really trying and i've been trying to um uh, go on this healing journey ever since i moved here which has been a little over a year ago and it's just been distraction after distraction you know what i'm saying every time you look around it's something so distraction after distraction excuse after excuse is basically what i'm sitting here making but you know what i'm saying i'm just really just ready for change like i didn't come if i felt like my move here was not gonna um aid in my change process then i wouldn't have made the move you know what i'm saying i stepped out on fate and moved to texas and I, i'm not saying i'm really enjoying myself but you know i made a wrong choice and we'll get into that you know those details later of, of, of the choice that i made that really really has not been good for my life at all y'all so i mean i'm right now in constant battle constant warfare you know just trying to get my spirit right get my spirit man right and every time i I, I try it's like every time I get in God's presence and every time I cry to God and I ask for forgiveness and I try to get purify my heart the enemy hits me with a punch like seriously like and so it came up today y'all and I feel good about it I did really well I didn't respond like I normally do I didn't do a lot of going back and forth which I really should not have just said anything at all but I did good. I didn't revert. I, I didn't revert back to that bitter woman of God that I have been. So if you you think you can't be bitter and be a woman of God, the bitter woman of God is what I have been. So I'm being transparent, parent, and being straight up, uh, keeping it 100 or 1,000 with you have you want to say about about me I, i'm not gonna fake and say i got it all together god has given me so many chances chance after chance after chance in life you know to do it his way to do it right you know what i'm saying you know he, he keeps telling me i can't prosper you till you do what i tell you to do because you gotta know that i mean business with you so y'all i'm just really 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 trying to you know to just do it right like i've been trying and trying and trying and it had got so bad y'all that i would wasn't even going into god's pregnancy presence because i was too ashamed after after i had acted out and and cussing and arguing and fussing i was too ashamed to even get in god's presence and i don't want to be that woman no more you know what I'm saying? I wanna, I wanna be everything that is shown about me. I want it to be real. You know, I wanna, I wanna be 
I want to be pleasing in his sight. I want everything that I do to please God. I, I want everything that I touch, everything that I say, every word that come, everything, every word that comes out of my mouth be something that's pleasing to him. Be him, not me. I'll decrease. I'm willing to decrease totally so that he can in, increase in my life. And I know I say, be careful what you ask for. Be careful when you tell God yes. Because you think all hell has broken loose already. But when you really make up in your mind and really tell him yes. <laughs> when I tell you this has been a fight, this has been a fight, this has been a fight. But it was only because I wasn't letting God do it. I keep trying to do it myself. <laughs> I'm just praying for sometimes spirits connect themselves to you. So even though you might get out of one thing or you might end one friendship or relationship or whatever, and then you might meet someone else and that same spirit is theirs because that spirit has connected itself to you. It's connected itself to you totally. So, so because of that, because it has connected itself to you, it don't matter who it is, who the person may be, the spirit is still there. So I'm asking God to de disconnect every spirit that's unlike him that has connected themselves to me, that has bonded themselves to me. That's what, that's my request right now. Everything that's not everything that, that that attracts negativity, everything that attracts things that are not God, like God, I'm asking Him. About to meet y'all. Okay. You didn't pay this just around come. Huh? It looked like he had a good his head. Do this yeah, time. I know. I was paying attention to him. That's why I stopped the trouble. What do? He scared the best out of me. You ain't seen it. I seen good his head. And I slowed down so he can walk in front of me. Cause I need to hit him with this play. Uh -huh. He walked that way. Don't even look for him. Nah, I'm just watching her cause she knows she got some TVs in that car. I'm following her house. So how would you say? Y'all, I apologize. I did not even show y'all what the food looked like. Um, I just started eating because I was like hungry, hungry. So, but just to give you a quick review, um, yeah, it's it's pretty good. It's tasty, but it's got a little spice to it. I don't care for spicy food at all. Um. Wasn't it? it was really good. The rolls was fresh. Um, the chicken was fried very well, and it does it does have a good flavor, so it's okay. I wouldn't say that it'll be something that I would to die for for me because I don't care for a, a spicy food. To each his own. I know a lot of people love spicy food, but I'm just one of those persons that don't. And yes, I am from Louisiana, born and raised. But I don't want my tongue burning while I'm eating. So, oh y'all, I just want to come in and give y'all a quick review on it. It's pretty good chicken. Um, it tastes pretty good. It's good. No lie. I think when I first moved to Houston, someone told me that the chicken wasn't good, but it is good, y'all. So, so I need to move. And I just want to come in and get y'all a quick review. I'm going to go ahead and finish eating. And I'll probably talk back to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Y'all, yeah, I didn't even finish what I was saying. About me just becoming. Basically, all I'm saying is I'm just tired of the woman that I have, have become. And I'm ready to become a better person. And I refuse to let the enemy keep attacking me or keep blocking me from moving forward in life. I just refuse to do it. So... Just like I told y'all yesterday, I'm going to be still and know that it's God from now on in my life. I got to.
So, like I said, I did you try today. The enemy tried me. And he still tried me. I'm getting text messages. And I'm just not going to do it. I'm not going to reply. So, anyway, you guys, y'all pray for me. Keep me in your prayers. Then I get delivered from this. In Jesus' name, that I get delivered from the curse of the enemy. We declare it. And the blood of Jesus is against it. And of course, we give God all the glory. All right, I'm going to get back with you guys later. Now, her, it's pretty good, y'all. I don't know if it's good because I'm hungry. Um, I mean, it's not better than Southern Classic, y'all, but it's good. Um, He's out.